Before the 11th of September, the idea that Americans would voluntarily agree to live their lives under the gaze of a network of biometric surveillance cameras, peering at them in government buildings, shopping malls, subways and stadiums, would have seemed unthinkable, a dystopian fantasy of a society that had surrendered privacy and anonymity. Jeffrey Rosen The problem with the so-called bloody surveillance state is that it's hard work trying to track someone's movements using CCTV, especially if they're on foot. Part of the problem is that the cameras all belong to different people for different reasons. Westminster Council has a network for traffic violations. The Oxford Street Trading Association has a huge network aimed at shoplifters and pickpockets. Individual shops have their own systems, as do pubs, clubs and buses. When you walk around London it is important to remember that Big Brother may be watching you, or he could be having a piss, or reading the paper or helping redirect traffic around a car accident or maybe he's just forgotten to turn the bloody thing on. Ben Aronovich. Like a black hole, NSA pulls in every signal that comes near, but no electron is ever allowed to escape. James Bamford, The Shadow Factory. Premises. The suspect, a male in his 20s, took flight after being confronted by staff and escaped in a dark-colored Commodore sedan. Police have examined CCTV footage and expect to make an arrest soon.